everyone. First at five, students in Manatee County, some of the first in the Bay Area to head back to school. Today, more than 50,000 students returned to class with 70% attending a brick and mortar school at least part of the time. ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane has more on what the first day was like for students returning for in-person learning. For the first time since March, Manatee County students are able to walk into classrooms again, but this first day of school looks different than ever before. Face masks are the first thing you'll notice on the first day of school. Masks are required to be worn by everyone with a few medical exceptions. Also, parents are not allowed inside of schools. Manatee High School was even doing temperature checks before entering the building. This all in an effort to have brick and mortar classes, but also try to protect against the spread of COVID-19. The district released these photos showing a glimpse inside of classrooms. We spoke to some students after school. Most say they felt the school was doing everything possible to keep them safe, but it definitely wasn't the same as a normal first day of school. Nobody knew what to expect. You, don't, you can't really sit in groups anymore. It's, it's really just separation. You gotta keep your mask on, they're really on to you about that. Wearing these masks are really annoying. You can't really see anyone's face. However, students did tell us they were happy to be back in school. Manatee County School District says as of this afternoon, they have not had any students or staff with positive cases of COVID-19. In October, parents can decide if they want to switch their child's learning from in-person, online, or the hybrid option. In Manatee County, Wendy Lane, ABC Action News.